the me human Steve Dyer. He is a well-known figure in South African music, and he's come up with something that actually earlier this year started at the Soweto Theatre, and it's a production that has just grown leaps and bounds. It's called Color Me Human. Steve, thank you very much for joining me, Amara. Is, Steve, when you put something like this together, do you even begin to conceptualize that it has life past the original venue? Because I remember interviewing you and we were talking about the Soweto Theatre and what made it an amazing space. And then we talked about Amara and this, this, the collaboration stuff. And now you've moved to another venue and it's second edition. Yeah. Well, I think the concept and the idea and if I can say the profundity of the concept, mm. it's been a long time in <coughs> incubation. And I believe it's a concept that will just grow and grow and grow. So I'm not really surprised, but I'm thankful for the opportunity again. And also what this does, Amara, and you become more and more comfortable with the content because now you've worked out whatever the issues were, Steve, on stage, what it looks like, what it feels like, and you can now add things, perfect things. We're essentially not seeing the same show, are we? No, no, it's not the same show. We've had the opportunity to grow in the music, grow in the script, grow in the choreography, um, and the concept as well. We've actually been going back and forth discussing all sorts of ways to expand, not just in theater, but in concert and in film. And there's just so many ways to take this particular concept. We're very excited. Yeah, when she says, I'm very excited. That <laughs> begs the question, uh, you're onto the Joburg Theatre now. Yes. What are the plans for the production? It now almost by popular demand has to kind of move across the country. Yes, well, we've put in proposals and we wait to hear. But I think you're right. It, it's, it's word of mouth. It's people coming. Mm. Um, we had a, the opening show on Friday evening. And you know, you have some shows where it's opening night, so people stand and... How was Friday? Standing ovation, and people really got, it was you know, amazing. they were really touched. Mm. And that's the thing about it, is that if you can, with the idea that our most positive, powerful, and unifying life force is, all, is that we are human, we get to the core and the fundamentals of, mm. of our existence. And if you look at our troubled times today, given these, um, these problems in France and tragedies and, and intolerance through mm. whichever levels, like spiritual, social, political, mm. this is a message that appeals to everybody to say that, look, whatever your, your affiliation, we are all at our core human. Mm. So there's no us and them, but there's only us. And the audience really got it on opening night, so it was it was I felt really that. That liberating. Was yeah. and does do, does this production stretch your mind and your ability a little bit? Because um, Steve is one of those people that, he, when he creatively, he can be quite insular and then expect <laughs> you to deliver. So <laughs> does know, it stretch your mind a little bit? It does. I, I, it does, and I think that's so important. I feel like. Um, a lot of the feedback that I got from the fans was they didn't know what to expect. Yeah. And by the time they walked out of there, they're like, oh my God, my mind has just been blown and stretched out. And they didn't see it coming that way. Um, and we had it the same way in, in, in terms of production and that kind of thing. And it's so important. That's the point. We're supposed to grow and we're supposed to learn as we go every day. So there's something new. There's something popping off in, in our dress rehearsals. There's something different on stage that happens absolutely every night. I promise that. And it fan it's fantastic because they feel it. They get it when they come to the show. Okay, we've run out of time, but I'm going to urge everybody to go and check it. It's running at the Joburg Theatre. Uh, it's on until the 29th of November. And you know by now, I'd like you to take your friends, your family, and your enemies. It'll bring <laughs> you together. Uh, Steve Dye has created something <laughs> exceptional. It's called Color Me Human. It started early in the year at the Soweto Theatre and has now moved on to the Joburg Theatre. Can you imagine? Okay, that's where we leave it for now. Let's go to the performance area. For me, it's Cha Cha. All right, that's it.